The Outlook for Sunday is a sustainability film challenge for young people, which is now calling for entries. Young people, it's probably why I can't do it. Our actor and ambassador, Leisha Ward-Knox, joins us now to tell us all about it. I'm curious, what is a sustainable short film challenge, Leisha? So it's any short film up to five minutes long based on the themes of sustainability. Wow. So whatever somebody interprets sustainability to be like, I think uh, sometimes we assume it's just got to do with the environment, but there are other interpretations too. We were talking just before when you were off in the corner there mm -hmm. getting a drink about um, sustainable jobs. Like as an actor, very hard to have sustainable jobs for long term. But no, I bet, I bet. But this is a good way, I guess, for people to yeah. get their foot in the door, isn't Someone it? Someone should make a I film think... about that, shouldn't they? They really, really should. <laughs> <laughs> and what is the age criteria? Because I was asking you before, am I too old? Yeah, I think we're all too old. <laughs> Up to 24. Oh, yeah. Oh, just so. missed out, hardly by a bit. Just a tiny little bit. Yeah. <laughs> so what sort of films, are, what's the sort of, how long has it been running for? So it's been running for 10 years. Um, the, that's the uh, film challenge itself. Um, but recently they've also started up workshops across New Zealand. So uh, basically they decided that they wanted to make sure that everyone felt empowered to enter. Um, and so all across the nation we're offering free filmmaking workshops. Awesome. Hey. Yeah, it's really cool in all the districts and so what sort of things have you seen like what sort of films have come in before oh amazing there was one in particular that sticks in my mind it was about every dollar you spend being a vote for the company that you're spending it on so keeping that company clever. up and going and yeah. that's good so it really does matter where you spend your money yeah it was so clever wow and how important is this you know for New Zealand arts I think it's really important. It gets um, people involved from a really young age. Like there, um, there's no lower age limit, so there's like five-year-olds making films. So, yeah, it's just getting people up, and, and it's not a competition. It's a challenge. So it's about just putting your best foot forward. Okay, yeah. but is there a prize with said challenge? <laughs> there are prizes. There are 20 winning films, and. Um, uh, one of the prizes, uh, you get mentored by um, the producer of the film Orphans and Kingdoms. Oh, wow. Which was a New Zealand film um, directed by Paolo Rotondo, which was amazing, and I'd encourage mm. everyone to see it. Um, and uh, there's heaps of goodies. There's, like, body shop vouchers. And... So say we were 23 and we yes. wanted to enter ourselves <laughs> into this. What do we need to do? Um, so you just need to make a short film. You could come along to one of the workshops, that would be amazing. Um, that will give you the skills to um, make the short film. Um, explore the theme of sustainability in your unique way. Um, and yeah, put it together. The deadline is the 9th of September. So just um, go to the website and... And did you say those workshops are free? Yes. Okay, that sounds good. And the address is on screen if people want to go to the yeah, website and find some yeah. more details. Yeah, and there's uh, one-day workshops and there's two-day Kaupapa Māori workshops wow. which um, look at sustainability from a Māori perspective. Awesome. So. Okay, now, look, something else I want to talk about, because your last name, are, re are you related to Chris Knox? Yeah, he's my papa. <laughs> is he really? Yeah. No, fantastic musician. Did you get any musical ability from him? <laughs> <laughs> that's ability. <a> yes. <laughs> that's like <laughs> I play the ukulele. Oh, nice. Oh, nice. Does that count? Yeah, no, that counts. That's good enough. Yeah. A new millennium, really, isn't it? <laughs> oh, I was like, if the five-year-olds can do it, I can do it too. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Sit in my living room. <laughs> I can do a song. Yeah. Good on you, Alicia. And Alicia's yeah. also studying psychology too at university. She forgot Forever. to say that little bit as well. Very talented oh. lady. Oh, thanks. So applications for the Outlook for Sunday program close on September 9th, as Alicia said, so check out their website for the details.